We've been fooling with this thing all day. All day. I done got tired and fed up with the motor. And I went on here and tried to get another one. And in the middle of that, I'm trying to work on the big truck. And it's, I can't even get the big truck to act right. And I'm just, and then the 81, it's just, you know what? I don't know what, now I'm on the combine and I'm, I'm trying to get, man, I sweat, boy. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, D-Wade, once again. Of course, you already know that. Down here, uh, what we're doing, we're servicing up the combine, getting it ready. Uh, getting it ready for next week. So that's finna be gone, starting Monday. So I'm gonna vlog that when I drive it down there to Tennessee Track. I know I've been saying that all the time, but y'all, hey. So I got my brother, he's over here, uh, blowing out the combine. So I'm gonna take, so while he's doing that, I'm gonna take and unhook this, and I need to hook that to the bush hog so I can start cleaning up around here, move stuff around. I got the water wagon down there at the, at the water hydrant filling up, and got it hooked to the 4640, the tractor. I'm gonna use that to blow out this, to wash out this radiator, and we gonna use the water wagon as well to wash out the combine. So I don't want to send it to John Deere Nasty. So, uh, so while we got, while I got help here, so I'm gonna put him to work and myself to work as well. And as far as the 86, I need to clean that up. I think I'm gonna go ahead and send that along with the combine, let the 86 and the combine go. The John Deere, the only thing the 86 got is that leak. The leak between the wiggle tail, I think it's right there on the drive shaft. So to me, it's like it's a seal or whatever. So I'm gonna walk down here, since we now I got that out the way. So I'm gonna walk down here and get this tractor and I'm gonna pull it up here. That way I have it ready and uh, get ready for wash out. I'll probably just wash this out first while Damien is still blowing the combine out. So all right, let's all get right, ready. So now I got the water wagon. So uh, like I said, I'm gonna pull it across the road. So I'm turning around over my grandmama's driveway. All right, so now we got we got this here. So now I need to go and get some gas to put in here. That way I can wash wash this radiator off, wash the engine off, and then when Damien get done, we'll move the tractor over there. That way I can clean this up and get it slick. Then I gotta break the take this this right here loop and hook to the bush hog. Uh, I wish I had my DGI. I think I, no, my DGI at the house. Dang it, again. I'm gonna go up there and get it. All right, now I done broken loose from the, the drill. So we done with that, since I'm done with that. Uh, only thing I just need is just to clean it up. Now that second wheat field, I was gonna drill it, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bush hog it down and then I'm gonna burn it down. And then I just let it stay burned and then uh, I'm gonna get the ripper and now I'm just gonna rip that ground because I know the germination is gone on, on that farm so I'm just I'm just gonna refix it and rebuild it <clears throat> so when I get done with that then 
The next day. Hi, right, y'all. Now we're rolling into the next day. Uh, we got the uh, combine cleaned out, uh, blowed out, I mean. And uh, my brother, he's gone back. He has to fly. He's going back to Dallas, ain't it? So uh, we were having problems with this motor right here. I got so sick and tired of it. We was taking, me and Damien, we was taking turns, jaking that rope off, and we couldn't get nothing to crank, and then I got fed up with it, and so I went and bought a brand new one. Oh, on, see, took it off of right here. There it is right there. So when we went and bought a brand new one, and I filled it up with gas, we filled it up with oil. Here it is right here. Now this thing done pissed me off so much. We were doing the same thing as that other one over there. So we kept jacking it off, jacking it off, jacking it off, and it still wouldn't hit. So I was like, you know what? Just take it off and I'm finna send it back because I'm I'm getting fed up with this. I'm sick and tired of just doing stuff. And so the phone better the phone head went dead, my vlog head went dead, so which means I'm rolling on to the next day. So uh, what I did was I just sat and thought about it last night, came here, and um, something told me just to look at the oil, check the oil again. So I checked the oil, so I tilted and checked the oil, and uh, come to find out, it wasn't hardly even none in it because I thought we just pulled enough oil in it. I didn't want to overfill it, so... So now the thing, so I fill it up with oil. So now the thing cranks. Oh, my brother sees this. He's going to be pissed. And man, I tell you, we've been dealing with this thing all day. Right after when the phone battery went dead, we started tackling the this. And then I just, I, I just got pissed off. And I said, man, I done threw this thing about five or six times across across the dirt. I was, man, I was mad. It's a good thing I didn't vlog that because, man, I was so pissed. I done picked that thing up right here and just tossed it way out there. And I'm like, I can't get nothing to work around here. I'm like, it's bad enough. I ain't got no help. I ain't got nobody to come down here and come help me. And plus, on top of that, how to deal with this thing. See, now I'm getting upset. Plus, I had to deal with this thing. And let me show you what this. This right here had broke off. From right here to right here. See, I don't even have a flange. So I had to rig it some kind of way just to pull that together. And then if you look, I had to put a pipe down through there. See? I had to put a pipe down through there and then I had to go cut it and I had to borrow some tools and then this right here had fell off. I don't, oh man, I was upset yesterday, man. And I just put it back together. This right here was leaning, so I don't know how in the world that, I just don't know. And then so, so anyway, I got this one fixed. And then, so I was dealing with this right here, which is this right here. I, I don't, you know, me and Damien lost all kind of time yesterday. We 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 lost everything. And cause we, we I was supposed to move stuff around. It's about to rain. Yeah, it's thundering out here, which is I don't care. Cause I you know what? Let me just let me just get this together. Alright, now I got the motor on. I didn't want to vlog it because it's a little sprinkling out here. So now I got it on. So that's the new one, and that's the old so, one. So, Damon, you watching? I don't know, man, but it's running. Dad's doing that, which is I don't care, as long as it's pumping. I don't know why it's doing that, but I don't care. 
So I'm gonna put the vlog down and we're gonna check it out, see how it shoots. That look pretty good. Yeah. I'm gonna get on and move it over there to the to the grass part and clean it up some more. Alright, well, I'm gonna move to the 86. I'm gonna move this up just a little bit over there in the grass and then I'm gonna take it back across the road, take the water wagon, back across the road and let it fill up with water so I can finish washing out the combine. So right now I probably got a little bit of 250 gallons, so I'm just gonna waste that, put that over here. I just moved the tractor out of the way, the 86, uh, 81 out of the way, so I'm just gonna put, uh, I'm just gonna hose the 86 down, that's all, and wash it off. So let me get that going and set the DTI and then that way I can that way I can clock. here so I'm just gonna fill it up and I'm gonna rinse off and wash off some more ain't nothing like ain't nothing like whale water boy I'm 
All right, I'm gonna let that be filling up and I'm gonna get on the combine and move it in this grass right here. So the 86 and the combine is the one I wanna wash out. So me and my brother agreed to send the combine to, whew, send the combine to Tennessee Tractor and send the, and not send the 86 out to get that leaf fit. <clears throat> Whew. All right then, I'll get back with you in a minute. All right, now I got all my tractors moved. I got the 86 right here. I'm just gonna let it run a minute. Let the air conditioning be cool. It ain't ran in a while since I left from Jackson, Tennessee. This is that ground for uh, that pretty so I got the 46 Look to the water wagon. So I'm gonna leave it running. I'm just gonna do this one side and then wrap it back up and then drive the 46 around on the other side so I can spray that. So I'm just gonna get the mud off the tires right here. Well, look at it, you guys. Finally got some help. My wife done came down here and helped me. How about that? Boy, ain't God good. Oh, I watched the call, too. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do one more filling. We're gonna do one more filling. So I got the combine clean. We're gonna do one more filling right here. Then we're gonna get the 86. The only thing I'm gonna do is move this out the way. Why my camera tilting? There we go. I'm gonna move this out the way. All right. Okay, it looks like it's finna storm right over here, back here, behind, behind my head. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash this off right fast. Water wagon, so I'm just gonna put this down somewhere. So let y'all see. So let go. Hit the notification bell as I win out here. So I can holler at you later. Whoa!